This is Ricky, and today I'm going to talk about EC2. Today's session will be more on a demo wise. So I'm just going to go briefly how to make a cam EC2 instead of what it is and everything. Haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. And I'll share the videos I do. So, an instance it's a wide selection of instance types optimized to different fit different user cases. Instance types compared to various combination of C E. And you memory storage and network capacity. And I'll show this in my demo mode. So in EC2, which one is for Amazon, it lets the computer think. It's flexible, it's wide scalable, it's reliable, it's secure, it's inexpensive because you're paying per users, easy to start and elastic, and it's completely controlled. I something to know it does integrate with other sources for like Amazon Elastic Block Store, Amazon CloudWatch, Amazon Virtual Private Cloud, AWS Identify and Access Management, AWS Batch, and Amazon EC2X. And then before I go to the demos, I have just want to share it to you that uh, in let me just open my okay okay so you see the code so each region has their own uh, like code you can use it's recommended to use the one closest to you always Um, not close to the entire, close to your customer. So if you say if you're in uh, Europe, but your customers are in Canada, then you probably choose the Canada one. And then, and then yet to, I've showed the demo now, so because it will. You want to stand more better with the camels. Yeah, and let me set code. Okay. So I'm in my AWS console right here. So what I'm going to do is go click on services, click EC2. I have it easy to run it, but I'm gonna make a new one to show you how to create one. So I could go to instance, create a new instance. So the, the first step is to choose your machine image. So do we have like Windows, Linux, Red Hat, Jupyter, Uber2, But uh, and also if you go at the side, so here you can choose from the marketplace. So you can have like there's like different products and services. Um. So in the marketplace, you can have like let's say if I'm looking for a business application, there's a WordPress, which will it's used it often. There's a phone system. It's codes. I could even search. Um, let's say if I want to make a shop, a shopping. So um, for e commerce lots of that's my people, that's bread store shops. 
and uh, that's all the like shopping cards uh, platforms. The one I would recommend, I don't know if it would be here for shopping cards. I don't think it's here, but that's one. I really like a shop. Okay. It's okay. Um, so the way one we're going to be creating, let me just create the hit. Set. We can create an open tool. Okay. I'm just, um, so it's like that open tool server 2.4. I just see this one. So we're just going to click the select. Then now we can look at the type of, uh, of uh, instance. So in my example, I am fine with, uh, for this example, because I'm going to read it, I can use the T2 micro. And because I'm on a free tier anyway, so it's free for a year. But depending on your requirement, you would need to pay to start that. It's like a lot. So you have to look at based on your requirement, how much uh, memory you need, how much internal storage, which kind of internal storage uh, repeats you, you need, how many. Okay, let's go to, then I'll click next. Um, okay. Yeah, I'm on. I have to check this. So you can change the number of instance here. Or your large auto scale group, which will auto, like it says over here, it will automatically scale it, page out to collect the instance. So, let's say if you have one EC2, but you have your instance, it can have many. And you can also here put the IP address, so a public IP address. I'm going to make sure it's enabled. I know that default ones, the uh, echo rates are default, but I want to make sure it's enabled. And then here, let's say if you have an IAM row, so you can create an IAM row here, but um, that would be huge story for this one, but I'm not going to need that. A monitor link, if you want to connect to the CloudWatch, Yeah, I think the latch of my setting search so is uh, the default one. So we're going to go to next. Uh, for so, yeah, this one, the adding storage. HEP is fine with me. HSD general is fine with me. You can find out the different types over here, what each one is. But the uh, Everything looks fine for me. So I'm just going to go to the next. Text, uh, let's say if you want to group them by that like, project, uh, if you work on many projects or team names, you can click here. I think you can also put the uh, I am uh, policies based on those instances. And then security groups. So we could create a security group. So over here we have, um, I'll just leave it, I'll just call it text, that is a text one. And that's just age, it's fine. And then you just give me a warning because I have IP, I just do open public. Um, since I did that, I should also put an uh, HTTP. So I say HTTP eight port is, but uh, keep it uh, whatever the IP address and HTTPS same thing. Okay. So and then over here you just review to make sure it's not correct. 
and then the, you click launch. Once you click launch, it will ask you to create a public key or a private key. I go use the next Steam key, so I'm just going to use the Mickey Qua. And then I just click on knowledge. Because this key you cannot access without it. So make sure you have this key. If you make a new one, you have you can download the key and then save it. And then you just click launch. And it just launches the game instance. And it's pending right now, but you, you could go in and see. I created a public IP right there. Uh, the information I could check here. I could check over here the once it's running, I could monitor to it. Right now, I don't think anything will show because uh, it's not uh, running right now. If I create tags over here, that started storage information, the network security and detail. I be check if it's, yep, it's initializing, so it should be ready soon. But that's how you make a EC2 instance. Yep, and why right, that's that's all for this video. If you please make sure to subscribe, like, share this video, and that's all. I'll see you next time. Okay, right, bye.